is your teacher Abby and welcome to High English. Today we're going to cook alamang omelette. He's carrying his fish net. Let's take a look at his catch. Wow. There's a very, very small shrimp there. And good. It tastes very good, especially for omelette. I'm gonna cook this later. This is very small, small shrimps, pepper to taste, oil, cooking oil, we have onion leaves. So everything tastes better with onion leaves. This is the secret of the chefs. Next we have onion, lemon, salt, rock salt. We have egg and we have the fork for beating the egg. Okay, so first we prepare the ingredients. Let's prepare the onion. Okay, so I remove the skin of the onion. Okay, when the person is onion skin, it means the person is very sensitive. Okay, so this is the onion skin. So we remove the skin. You peel, peel the skin of the onion. Peel the skin, this is white onion. Next, we chop the onion. Chop, chop the onion into small pieces. Chop. Chop the onion into small pieces. Next, the onion leaves. So, we remove this part. Then we chop it into small pieces. Chop into small pieces. Everything tastes better with onion leaves. It adds color to the food. Okay, color and flavor. Okay, so now it's time to crack the egg. So we have three eggs. One, two, three eggs. So there's a saying or there's a line that goes, it comes in threes. So when something bad happens, maybe three bad things happen, you say it comes in threes. Also, when there are three good things that happen, you say it comes in threes, okay? So we have three eggs, we say it comes in threes. Okay, so first we crack the egg using a fork. Crack. One, two, and three. Okay, so three eggs. By the way, what you see is the egg white. Okay, this one is called the egg yolk. Egg yolk. Next, we beat the egg using fork. Using a fork, we beat the egg. Beat, beat the egg. We put the onions. And the onion skin. Uh, I mean, the onion leaves. Put the onion leaves. The onions and we put the small shrimps maybe just enough yeah. I bought these uh, small shrimps from the beach yeah okay so this is ready for frying so we hit uh, we add Pepper to taste, pepper, ground pepper to taste. 
you mix and then it's time to fry put some oil into the pan so let it heat for a while yes. okay I'm so excited this is a very cheap but very delicious this is kind of salty actually so I don't want to put additional oil to make it saltier this is enough okay so I can feel that the oil is hot enough hot enough so let's add this Okay, so it looks delicious. When it's strong enough, that's the time we flip it. Okay, so here, we flip. Oh gosh! It's better to put cornstarch actually. Cornstarch makes it stronger. So this is not such a success, but it's edible. Edible means you can eat this. Okay, it's edible. The opposite of edible is inedible. Inedible means you cannot eat it. Okay. Edible means you can eat it.